Hey, hello everyone. Welcome back to my channel. I am Nisha Singla and in today's session, we are going to solve one more problem statement of JavaScript. So recently I got one DM and the person was talking about his interview experience and there he come up with one problem statement. He mentioned like he was not able to solve that. So let's see how to solve that problem. So let's understand the question first. The question is like we have a string something like this, like I love JavaScript. And now the expected output is every word of this sentence we need to reverse. So let's understand how we can solve this problem statement. So first of all, I want to tell you like how many functions I'm going to use to solve this problem. So I'm going to use one function that is called split, which is basically used to convert your string to array. And the second function is of course the reverse function which is basically used to reverse a string. And the third function I'm going to use is join, which will do the opposite of split. If we have array and I want to convert it to string, then I'm going to use this join function. So as of now, we will use these three functions and let's see how we can use this one. So first of all, let's create a simple function that will say reverse string. And of course, at the end, I will call this function somewhere. So I'm just creating a structure first of all, so that I can explain you the logic. I have one variable input in which I will hold my this data, right? So it's just my simple string. And I will pass this variable to my reverse string function and I will hold it here in a variable of maybe data. So if you do console.log as of now, you should be able to get the same, same output of this I love JavaScript. So first thing th that is very clear that every character of this word we need to reverse. So first of all, I need to get a hold of every individual word. It's a complete string, right? So to work on every individual word, first of all, I need to convert it to an array because array work on index position. So if I, if I have it as an array, I can easily hold this as one index, this one, another index, right? So first step would be converting this string to array. And I told you like split method is used to do so. So what you can do, you can simply say here, maybe array input and I will use data dot split method. So wherever I have white space on the basis of that, I'm just wanted to uh, convert this string to an array. So if you do console.log and just log this variable, you will notice you will get an array now. So now I got it as an array and I have a hold of every individual word. So first step is done. Now next is I have to, again, I need to work on every individual index as well so that I can reverse this string. So I have to visit every element of this array. So for that, what you can do, you can use any array method. So I will use map method on this in array input. And if you notice, now you will get a hold of every individual element. Fine. Now the next step that you need to do, I need to reverse this string. Here I will say reverse a array, okay. So as this, this is a string, right? If I will say d dot reverse, it will not work because reverse is not a method of string. So it means I a reverse is a method of array object, right? So this reverse method will not work on D because D is a string and reverse is a method of array. So it means every individual array index, I need to further convert to array so that I can get a hold of every index of my this particular index. So same thing I will do. I will again apply a split method because now D is a uh, string for me. So I can again convert it to an uh, array, something like this. So if I run this one, you will notice every index further converted to an array. Fine. Now if you apply reverse method on this, it will reverse this complete array. Let's run this one. You can see it is get converted. Uh, so it get reversed. So my complete string now is re in reverse format. So as of now, I have used two methods, the split method to convert this particular string to array. And then on that uh, resulted array, I have applied a reverse method so that I can reverse my complete array. 
again i need to get a string out of it i don't want it as a array right so again at the end when once my operation is completed again i will convert this array to a string with the help of join method so if i run this one you will notice i have an array because i am applying my complete operation on an array but every index of my array is now get converted right so i can get it from this console.log because my logic is completed and then i can return this one and as it, i have used a map method so i can hold the output in a variable so if you print console.log result here you will get a array that have a reversed index like this but my output is i need a string and this is a array then what you need to do you need to convert this array again back to a string so i told you join method is going to use to reverse your array to string so what you can do you can return your complete result from here and you can convert it to string as well and of course to print this one either you can wrap this one in a console so that you can see the output fine so we got the same output which we were expecting so this is how you can solve this one it's all about you should comfortable about the string and the array methods so you can see majorly we have used these three method only uh, converting the string to array with the help of split method reversing the array with the help of reverse method and again converting the array back to string we have used this join method so with the help of these three methods we are able to achieve our output so this is how i have solved it if you have some better approach do let me know in the comment section and this is all for today i hope you liked the video if you liked the video don't forget to subscribe my channel and hit the like button i will see you in the next video till then keep learning